Hi, my name is Chelsea Table One. I'm from Coin Mobile Company. Today, I would like to teach you about how to use the pass symbol to send the multiple parameter between the activity in the single Java objects to make you understand what it is. I have created a workshop. In this workshop, I have two activity. One is the main activity. It acts as like a sender activity. Why detail activity is a receiver activity. In this case, I try to demonstrate. Uh, how to send the multiple parameter in two style. One is the old style and another one by using the parser. Okay. Um, at first, I will show you how to send in the old style first. In this case, you will see that I call this method, and in this method, um, have a code um to send the multiple value by using the intent extra. Mm -hmm. In this case, you have to define many key and value in order to send to another activity. In this case, it's a detailed activity. Meanwhile, in another activity or in the uh, receiver activity, you have to define the key to extract all parameters that you want okay, as well. But the problem is that if you have many key and value, you have to write uh, many lines of code. And even more, if you have to forward your data to another activity, you have to do the same like this. Okay, So this is not look. Professional to make it easier to look uh, and look professional. Uh, Android have provide um, an interface Java class named Parsable. Parsable uh, interface Java class allow you to send uh, the Java model or the Java bean um, to the intent extra like this. Okay, I will show you. First, you have to create the intent as same as the old style, and then you have to create your Java model like this, and your Java model should contain um, all parameters that you need to forward to another activity. And after you initiate your object and push all parameter value that you want, uh, you can uh, push this object into the intent X star like this. But you will see that there will be a problem because normally intent X star um, it doesn't accept uh, the normal um, Java model or Java bean. Um, to make it accept, you have to invent the parser first. The point is that how to do that. Okay, in this case, I have the Java bean called info. Mm -hmm. um, to make uh, to implement the parser, you have to write a code. But I have uh, the better way. Okay, I have I have the better way to do that. Uh, in this case, I will use a bug in. In order to install the bug in, you have to click at the preference first and then search bug in. And you will see bug in menu and click at the bug in menu and search parsable. And you will see this bug in. You have to install it. You might ask me to restart your Android CEO in order to update your bug in. And after that, go back to this Java model or Java bit and hold command key and press N if you want to see like this mm -hmm. and if you're using a PC uh, you have to hold the control key and press N no way mm -hmm. um, in this case you will see parser if you uh, already installed the bug in okay enter and then you just click OK and you will see that it will automatic generate um, necessary source code for you to make um, to make your Java model or Java bean um, to be able to put into the Java uh, into the intent extra and you will see that now there is no problem to put your Java model in the intent extra in order to get your data it's really easy mm -hmm. in this case I will comment this and uncomment this mm -hmm. in order to get the whole parameter you just use get possible extra and use the key as same as you define in the sender like this okay and then you will get all data mm -hmm. and you will see uh, it benefit if you need to forward this data to another activity like uh, in some project you have many activities right and you, you need to forward the object between the activity in this case, you can send this object to another activity really easy. Mm -hmm. Okay, and that's it. I will show you how it works.
um, I will show you the um, I will run to show you the result I will comment the old style first and run this okay there is no problem I hope this tutorial is will be useful for you thank you